Welcome guys to another how to draw video by Arjun Aki Ninja King and today I'm going to show you how to draw manga mouths. So the shapes you need to learn how to draw when drawing a mouth is an upside down triangle, a square, a rectangle. Okay, these aren't the perfect shapes. Could have done them in time lapse, but it shows not to. So, I'm going to move that up a little. So, what we're going to do is in order to draw a mouth, the easiest way, just for it to be there, just go ahead and draw a line. Is that easy for you guys? Okay, now let's give it a smile. Now there's two ways to do this. Draw a small dot, have it go down, up again, you got yourself a smile. You draw the bottom lip. There you go. There's another way to do it. Give him a smile, and actually, he's gonna be a little choppy. So, choppy smile, bottom lip. Okay, you can make it look sad. Sad mouth. Okay, now this is where the upside down triangle is gonna come in. This guy gives you a open mouth smile. This sounds weird, doesn't it? <laughs> so we get a triangle. There we are. And draw the teeth. And guys, this is how to draw for beginners, so I'm keeping it really basic. Try to follow along if you can. And you can draw it and take a picture and leave it on the in the comment section I'll check it out and see what you gotta get you guys gotta improve on so this next one is basically I guess I'll have to put a little detail in uh, it's gonna be a circle a circular shape that you go in and down and up again and then you draw your teeth you clean, clean it up. up. Clean it up a little. Okay, guys, now let's get a little bit, little bit more complex, okay? What we're gonna do is, for the next one, we're going to now move into the square or rectangular shape. So, you draw yourself a mouth, bring it down the lines, curve it up a little bit. If you see the lip is curved, uh, if you see the real ones, Draw the teeth, draw yourself a tongue. You can use lines like this to represent the back as well. Okay. There's many different ways to draw the mouth, but I'll just draw a few in time lapse real quick. Alright, guys, so I drew a few more examples so you guys can maybe follow along and see. So now let's get a little tougher. Okay, so we're gonna draw one that's more realistic. This is maybe a dude that's screaming. Okay, so I'm gonna draw a rectangle going down. Like this. And then rounding it up again. For example, like this. Okay. So it gets a little smaller as it goes up. Almost the same shape. So here what you're going to do is you're going to draw the teeth going inward. This could be a little tricky for the beginners out there, but try it. This is going to improve you a lot, trust me. So as you can see the teeth are going inward. You're going to do the same thing over here, you're going to draw the teeth. And you're going to have teeth going inward. If you want, you can line these two up. It doesn't really matter. You can actually even draw the teeth. You know, just add circles for each tooth. And the ones in the front, you can add lines here. And make it look realistic. And in the back, you get is the uh, <laughs> the throat where it goes down uh, yeah <laughs> here 
Here, I'm gonna draw another mouth. That's a little bit this more This is again open. a rectangle, guys. And the reason is, the more, if you wanna do complex shapes of the mouth, then you have to make sure that it is always square and always triangular. triangular. I mean, think about it. When is anyone's mouth triangular? Only in manga. You can make a cute and cuddly character that have triangular everything, you know? It's a cartoon, guys. Come on. Right? So, I mean, I could just do hundreds of these and you guys gotta see what, how you can draw different kinds of mouths and different kind of designs and shapes. Find your own style. It's really, it's really easy. You can look up your favorite anime show and you can draw you know look at those and learn from that I personally look up Dragon Ball Z and a lot of as you can see the more complex ones are from Dragon Ball Z let me show you a few more examples from the side so you would get the for example this guy nothing just no expression screaming ah. Maybe this guy is smiling, but like an anime style smiling, not realistic smiling. So I mean, yeah, there's many, many ways to do this. Alright, now, there's also your mouth on the side, as you can see here, left, right. So I mean, there's hundreds of ways that you could draw your mouth, you know, there's really no right or wrong way. As long as it looks realistic, or it looks like it's a mouth, then you're doing a good job, right? You can always experiment, make new ones. I'm gonna go for a little bit more triangular. You know, think about the character you have. If you have a realistic character, you're not gonna give them a simplified mouth, even in a very really complex mouth. And in drawing, every little detail matters. In manga, Every little detail from the eyes to the nose to the mouth. Everything matters, even the ears. Find your own style. Good luck to you guys. Ninja King, signing off.